And in some breaking news, it's coming in from the national capital. This is the latest as far as the Delhi building collapse case is concerned. Two children have been taken out of the debris uh, and uh, they have been found dead. In fact, a four-story building collapsed this morning. Some people are still fear trapped at this point in time. Three others have been rescued, including two children. However, two children who were also uh, trapped on the debris have been found dead. Uh, unfortunately, those are the latest details here coming in uh, at this point in time. This was a four-story building that uh, collapsed. Uh, Alok is joining us uh, for more details here. Alok, uh, what more can you tell us? Uh, any more details about this building? And importantly, if we know how many people could still perhaps be trapped. Well, Avni, uh, unfortunate uh, news that two kids basically uh, one is 12 year old another is 7 year old they uh, they are uh, no more they were taken out from this uh, debris uh, you can see my video journalist uh, satender jai showing you that how going on and there is uh, the suspicion uh, two or three more persons likely to be trapped you can see uh, the whole articles uh, which were uh, lying in the building which are kept in the building they are being taken out one by one uh, and in fact you can see uh, uh, that uh, the NDRF officials, police personnel, and all are there. Uh, it is possible, uh, po uh, there, there is the suspicion that there were two or three laborers who were working on the ground floor of the building. And definitely, uh, this is the matter of investigation because it was a four story building. And on the ground floor, there was a reconstruction work was going on, and there was a big, big drilling machine that was being used at the time when the building collapsed. And this is what the question that the people here around asking also that how this reconstruction or the renovation work was going on at the ground floor of the building that led to this incident happened remember the structure of this of this whole lane and the the, the whole uh, the houses which are uh, lying which are uh, uh, situated over here their condition is also not very fine because this is particularly very old area of the national capital north delhi's sabji mandi area uh, and in fact trom train used to Passed from this particular lane as well uh, uh, in early 30s and 40s. What we are learning, and this building which collapsed, which uh, it was around 60 year old. Uh, this is what the residents are telling to us. So definitely, the condition of that building was not so fine, and this led to this incident happened. Uh, as of now, one, two children who are just passing through this lane, uh, they, got, they got trapped in the debris and they died. One uh, shopkeeper uh, whose uh, shop, uh, that the pan shop, which was uh, uh, situated at the ground floor, that, uh, that pan shopkeeper is also critical and he is under the treatment in the hospital. Uh, and what we are learning, there are uh, four, three, four laborers who are working on the ground floor. They might be trapped uh, under the debris, and that is why the rescue operation is still going on. So, uh, and at, at both the side of this lane, if you see the houses are completely, many of the houses are under dilapidated condition, narrow lane as well. You, you can see this is uh, uh, Robin Cinema. This is one of the oldest cinemas of the national capital. You can see the structure of this uh, uh, this uh, this lane. So, uh, this is what the whole uh, area is about. So, as of now, what the police say, uh, the owner of the ground floor, he will be questioned and he will be definitely taken into the custody. Uh, as of now, police is trying to do the rescue operation and uh, wrap up as soon as possible. Uh, the NDRF team and other uh, fire department officials are on their job. We hope the rescue operation will be ended soon and those who are trapped, they will be taken out. Back to you. Yes, absolutely, Alok. So obviously the first uh, and most important thing right now is the rescue operations uh, to see if there are any more people who are perhaps trapped under debris. But the other important aspects that you were also pointing out that many of the buildings in that area are in a dilapidated condition uh, that uh, the building in question here which collapsed, there was construction work going on. So obviously questions now will also come up is whether that construction work was in fact uh, legal, whether there were permissions that were taken uh, and what about the state of the building? What was it supposed to undergo renovation? So all those kind of questions to look into lapses uh, have to be asked now.
Yes, definitely enforcement agency. That is, the Delhi police will definitely will look into it. Some of the residents are over here, sir. आप लोग यहीं के रहने वाले हैं. थोड़ा सा मैं यहाँ का area के बारे में बताइएगा. हालांकि बहुत चीज़ हमें पता है कि पुराना area है और घर जो है यहाँ पर हैं बहुत पुराने पुराने बने हुए हैं. किसी ने किसी ने अपना basement नीव जो है मजबूत कराई, किसी ने नहीं कराई. जिसका कारण है ये घटना हुई है. ऐसा लगता है. क्या बताएंगे सर कि घटने में इस यहाँ पर इस building में कौन कौन रहते थे? रहने वाले तो नीचे यहाँ पे सारी शॉप्स हैं और ऊपर सारे लोग रहते हैं और यहाँ पे सारे मिडिल क्लास हैं उससे भी लोअर क्लास के लोग रहते हैं रोज खाते हैं रोज कमाते हैं लेकिन मैं तो यही कहना चाहूँगा जब बिल्डिंग बनती है ऊपर से नीचे तक सबकी निगाह में बिल्डिंग रहती है उस टाइम तो कोई एक्शन होता नहीं और जब बिल्डिंग गिर जाती है जब सबके ऊपर एक्शन होना चाहिए लेकिन ये वो भी नहीं होता लेकिन ये जब ही क्यों होता है जब बिल्डिंग बनती है और जब कंप्लेंट जाती है जब कोई उस पर कोई कार्रवाई नहीं करता इस, इस वाली बिल्डिंग में भी यही हो रहा था नीचे बेस ग्राउंड फ्लोर पे कंस्ट्रक्शन हो रहा था जबकि ऊपर तीन फ्लोर थे बिल्कुल बिल्कुल ऐसे ही था नीचे ग्राउंड फ्लोर पे कंस्ट्रक्शन हो रहा था ऊपर तीन फ्लोर थे और वो एकदम जैसे बिल्डिंग ने झोल खाए एकदम नीचे बिल्डिंग बैठ गई और ऐसा हर जगह ऐसा ही है लेकिन एक्शन कब होगा इन लोगों पे ऊपर जो इन इस चीज़ों में शामिल है जो इन चीज़ों को देखते हैं और नज़रअंदाज कर देते हैं यहाँ पर कहाँ रहते हैं सर मैं अंदर आ रहेपुरा में रहता हूँ जी और मैं यहाँ पे सोशल वर्कर हूँ पिछले तीस साल से मैं यहाँ पे सोशल वर्किंग करता हूँ मैं यहाँ पे और बड़े तो आप अच्छा आपने एक चीज़ बोली सोशल वर्कर तो यहाँ पर लोग कंप्लेन वगैरह करते हैं आपने कभी दी है उन कंप्लेन पर कभी भी कोई भी कार्रवाई नहीं होती है एम सी डी को भी दी जाती है पुलिस को भी दी जाती है डी डी ए को भी दी जाती है एल जी को भी दी जाती है सबको दी जाती है मान्य कोर्ट को भी दी जाती है लेकिन कोई कार्रवाई नहीं होती इन लीगल कंस्ट्रक्शन भी एक कारण है टोटली इन लीगल कंस्ट्रक्शन एक कारण है बिल्कुल आज उस हादसे का भी कारण इन लीगल कंस्ट्रक्शन ही है क्या कर सकते छज्जे वगैरह एक्स्ट्रा बने हुए आप देखो ना किस तरह से सारी सारी बिल्डिंग है सारी देखो आप किस तरह बिल्डिंगें एक दूसरे से जुड़ी पड़ी है इसलिए बिल्डिंगें बची पड़ी है नहीं तो ये बिल्डिंगें कभी भी नीचे आ सकती है कभी भी वो बड़ा असर होता दिस इज ऑल्सो वेरी इंपॉर्टेंट एस्पेक्ट अवनी दैट देर आर इन लीगल constructions uh, used to also happen in fact if you see in this building in, at the ground floor there was renovation work was going on and drilling machine was being used definitely the building is old and uh, and uh, that perhaps is the reason in fact the dcp is with us sir if you say that uh, what how many casualties are there just 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 tell us what that uh, possibly right now uh, there are two casualties uh, or baki uh, jo we are clearing the debris possibly uh, we may get uh, around uh there are three more four or more people may be there inside okay sir uh, i am i am seeing you that you are also on the ground sara abhi aapko kitna time lagta hai ki how much how much time it will take to wrap up the thing in another hour hour or so so he is a dcp north who is n12 fonso who was tell, telling to us that there is a two casualty two casualty and definitely there is the possibility few persons are left and the operation is still going on back to you Yes, absolutely, Alok. Uh, thank you so much for getting us all of those details. We'll of course keep coming back to you as and when there are more developments.